All right, welcome back to MI Combo Gaming. Um, today I got a special video request uh, from my nephew, um, so we're gonna see what we can do um, for him. Uh, we're gonna name the world after him. Um, he's got two requests. I've got to build in the forest, and I've got to build or find diamonds all in this episode. So let's get started, shall we? Let's uh, edit. Oh, select a world. Uh, create new world. How about that? <laughs> Survival mode. Hardcore. That's what he requested. Uh, okay. Create new world. Let's do this. Let's jump into it and uh, let's have some fun. This will be my first uh, hardcore world. Uh, I usually do play Minecraft on hard when I do play. Um, so, let's turn on my headset so y'all can hear some stuff. Well, right now, right away, we got sheep. Sorry, sheepies. Don't mind me. even playing man we're just gonna jump right into this and get to some stone pretty much instantly because make this world just as easy as I possibly can Cobblestone pickaxe. <clears throat> and yes, I realize I just took my own step away. Lots of coal already. Big coal node. Oh, right in iron. Look at that. Hey. Oh, so I'm only gonna be one. No. No, 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 no. Alright. Um, so let's get some coal, get some more stone. directly into the Iron Age. So that'll get us Iron Axe, Iron Pickaxe. I don't know if we necessarily need a shovel right now. <sighs> but while we're waiting... Oh, let's not do it that way. Let's do it this way. We'll go blam, blam. Oh. If you guys don't watch Waddles, watch Waddles, and you'll understand why the red bed. Can't start a world off without a red bed. Alright, let's get to harvesting. This is not where we're going to stay. I just want to, since I hit it pretty big so far, I'm going to start uh, smashing out some wood. So that way when we get to where we are going, we will just be able to start building. So, also, 
hardcore is uh, crappy for multiple different reasons, of course, but uh, the first reason is you die, your world's gone. So, I mean, I could have an amazing start right now, fall into a chasm, and then that's it. <laughs> and then I have to start all over. Um, which we will do and until we... Yeah, we'll just continue the series. I mean, why not? Sounds like a fun series. I've never done a hardcore Minecraft series. We'll get some saplings. This is probably already done for. Um, so we'll make nothing in that menu. Uh, right into a taiga biome. Maybe we can find some sweet berries. If we find some sweet berries, that's a food situation. Look at that. Ooh, don't fall down in there. So this is our food situation already solved. So now we just need shelter, and we're right on top of a village. Like, what the heck? I am not complaining, but... Wow. <laughs> so, I had two before we go absolutely any further. I had uh, two requests for this world in the first episode. Is I had to course start the world build in a forest i don't know if a taiga biome counts we're, we're gonna build in a taiga biome um and then to find diamonds so the only thing we haven't done so far is build and find diamonds okay Ooh, look at that We got potatoes already. Uh, we're set. I mean, I'm not even joking. Potatoes for uh, a starting food. Like, and we got tons of bread, tons of potatoes. Got some cheese, sweet berries out the the wazoo. Pumpkin seeds. Man, we're we're good. Food wise, now all we gotta do is just figure out where we're going. Alright, let's go back over here and check this one out. Pull that grinding stone for sure. <laughs> That's gonna save us some uh some time. And a little bit of resources, getting our first set of, uh, it's not a full set, but it's decent. Huh. And a saddle. Huh. Huh. Hold on, huh. let, let me double check and make sure this is... Options, difficulty, hard, locked. Okay, so, yeah, we're... Definitely doing what we're supposed to. Holy cow, this thing's huge. Maybe it's just two villages that spawned in on top of each other, and maybe that's why it's so messed up? That is coming with me. Oh, no, it's coming with me, trust me. Let's see here. I don't necessarily want to build in the village. Uh, raids are a thing. So we'll come out this way. Go 
look and see if we find something that piques our interest. Someplace we can build. So this looks like he's got easy access, different tree types. Still in the taiga biome, uh, next to a partial plains bollent biome, maybe? Or just a regular biome over there? Got cows. Cows are good. Cows are great, actually. Kind of a nice little walkway we can turn into. Going down to the river. Cut that out. We'll build our house. Right here. Um, we're just going to do it nice and simple. Save as much wood as we possibly can. Style. Maybe even do a basement later on. Maybe. Yeah, I think a basement would do really good um, in the future. Not right now, obviously, because, well... Just trying to get the basics down. What I should be doing is I should be setting up something for food to start growing food. All right, let's work on the food situation, shall we? And so you can grow things within a four by four square of a water source. So one, two, three, four. Technically, we could grow things right there if we wanted to. Um, I'm just going this way for aesthetics, just to make it look pretty. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to plant a row of wheat. A row of potatoes. A row of potatoes. A row of wheat. You get the picture. So what this is doing right now for us is giving us and it's giving us the best opportunity for our, our farm to do the best it can. Um, I don't know if my house is too far away from my farm for it to stay active while I'm over there building. I don't know. But... Let's not think about that right now. Let's go uh, back over here. We will build a bridge of sorts to get to our house. We need to get some uh, quicker food going. So for the time being, we're going to just plant some sweet berries. Uh... Just because I do want to go get into a cave as soon as possible. And for that, we should have food. So this will keep us from getting uh, attacked by the bushes when we harvest them. Okay, now we can harvest the berries without getting stuck or damaged by them, which is a positive for us. 
a massive positive for us, actually. Okay, that's a skeleton. Skeletons are not good right now. And a creeper. Creeper already. Okay, so creepers are really bad at this time in the game. Especially when you're me, because I don't do creepers very well. And when I say I don't do creepers very well, it just means I suck at combat. Oh, skeleton. Skeleton. First monster of the game <clears throat> toasted. It wasn't a uh, gracious victory by any means, but a victory is a victory, right? So creepers will one shot you in this mod. I mean, not a mod, this isn't a mod, my bad. In this difficulty, creepers will one-shot you. And zombies in this one definitely have a horde mentality. You attack one within a certain range, they, uh, I'll come after you. Ooh, skeleton, and I just gave him way up. Oh, that was close. heck out of here right now. Let's see if we can make it back to our base and go to sleep, or we just signed our own death warrant. Alright, let's do our uh, do our best. Let's go find some diamonds. We're going to start a uh, mine right here. Kind of away from the cave, but... Okay, so before we get into it, let's look at uh, where we're at right now. What we want to be looking for is our coordinates. Which we're at 59 right now, we got to go all the way down to 11. So yeah, we'll be right back. Alright, little explanation of what we're doing right now. 
Um, we made it to do 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 Y eleven. Um, we built ourselves a little uh crafting slash furnace area. Um, and this is my hallway for the start of my strip mine. So basically, what I do is my personal preference is I make a little uh two by two hallway in one direction. For, you know, however long I decide to do so. And then I pick a direction and I start branch mining. And for those that are familiar with what branch mining is, is you just go off in one direction, you know, one by two hallway or is it two by one? I don't know. I can already hear lava. And then you mine all the ore that you find while you're doing this. Now this is going to give you some decent experience mining. And in fact, in my honest opinion, mining is like the best way to earn experience in regular Minecraft. Um, me personally, I fill in all the holes thereafter. We're going to have to go get some more food, but... Usually you'll keep enough, or find enough, material to keep you going while mining in these areas, like coal, so on and so forth, to keep yourself rebuilt as long as you brought enough iron and, or enough sticks, not iron, because you find iron, of course. So it's a pretty self-sufficient way of keeping on going, minus the fact that you know, you run out of food. So. We'll go this way until my pickaxe breaks. And then we'll uh, go get some more food. Now sometimes it can take minutes to find diamonds. Sometimes it can take hours to find diamonds. So we'll just uh, keep mining until we do. After this pickaxe breaks though, uh, I'm going to go get some more food and then come back down here and then we'll start a time lapse. Let's see what we got going on. Kind of nice. I need a water bucket though. So now we got obsidian when we want it. And there's our broken pickaxe. Alright, let's go get some food. Of course, we come up and it's nighttime. It's a risky take. Hopefully, we can go get to our bed before we blow up. Almost daytime. And they're all right around, <laughs> all right around our stuff. Alright. Let's see if we can't uh, beat some creepers. That is a win. 
for sure. before we dig out and around these diamonds because I know for a fact that there's lava all the way underneath him. I'm going to keep placing... Okay, so... Oh. Alright, let's record that again, shall we? So, as you look, yes, we found some diamonds. Uh, I dug all the way out and around it, um, put blocks underneath it because there was lava literally right there. So, and it looks like we've got a minimum of five. I don't think it's going to go up any further, and I know for a fact it doesn't go down. So, five diamonds is definitely not a bad way to start. Let's go up with six diamonds, seven diamonds, eight find out what the total is after we're done. I'm pretty excited about that. That's nine diamonds. Nine. That's, that's great. So that's our diamonds. Pretty excited about that. So, uh, yeah, let's get some of this iron and then uh, head back up to the surface. Lapis. Maybe we should. I don't have any just yet. Oh, and there's some coal. I keep going this way. There's going to be obsidian capable of getting. We'll be getting some obsidian now. because we uh, thought we'd build that underneath already. And we need some coal anyway, so... And this is 
reason number one why you don't want to dig straight down, especially when you're in an area like this, because... Looks like we'll just dig out this direction. Leave that lava alone. Lava. Lava. I don't know. Lava. I don't know why it went out of the way. Alright, there we go. We got some good stuff. Um should we make a diamond pickaxe? I think we shall. First diamond pickaxe. So I'm I'm kind of pretty stoked, man. We only went through one pickaxe. Yeah, I only only destroyed one iron pickaxe, or was it two? I think maybe two. We destroyed one on the way down. Two two iron pickaxes before we got our first diamond pickaxe, and we still got enough for more pickaxe or an axe or a shovel or whatever we want, really. So, anyway, let's uh, go back up top now and work on getting some other stuff, because now I think our next goal, and I think we'll do this next episode, should be Oh, it's not even going to show me because I'm not next to a crafting bench. Should be do 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 do. Not shown. Why is it not shown? Huh. Not showing an enchanting table. Anyway. I mean, technically, we can go make an enchanting table right now, but we need books and leather and all sorts of fun stuff, so we'll do that next. But first, let's go back up top. Oh, that is not what I wanted to see right now. Not what I wanted to see right now at all. That's what I want, though. I want you guys to kill each other. We're going to drink some milk before we go back to our village. Oh, damn you. Oh, uh, an enchanted crossbow. What do we get for an enchanted crossbow? Let's, uh, let's not even play around with it. Let's go get some milk.
tons of fish around here. Could have done fish for a food source. Okay, milk gets rid of bad elements, by the way. So now we can go back to that uh, village if we wanted. And we got a uh, enchanted crossbow. Not the best weapon in the world, but when it comes to shooting skeletons or creepers, it is absolutely better than what we had before. All right, we're back. Um, we did a little bit of building off camera. Uh, camera died, actually, so let's just be real about it. <laughs> camera died. Um, so we did some building off camera. Um, <laughs> The wandering trader came by, actually dropped his leads, didn't kill him this time for him. Um, for the leads, at least. Uh, so we got our door uh, for our entrance, which is going to come down from this. I'm going to work on this, make it a little bit better. Um, and then it's going to come into what I want to think. I I'm, I'm think I'm just going to add a kitchen area. I'm trying to do a... Trying is the keyword. Trying to do a uh, fireplace in here. We'll see how well that goes. Um, black stained glass. Most of the way through. I don't know if I'm going to keep a window here. I don't think I'm going to actually. So let's just fill that in. Um. I got the view of the, the village over here and where my bed's at. I got this really nice view over here. So this is going to be my house. I do have to do quite a bit of uh, farming in order to get uh, the rest of the stuff done. I'm going to build a roof. Um, yeah, I planted one of those in front of my door. That's, that's a, an amazing first step. Um, the roof that I'm going to build... Um, going to do the best I can. Uh, like I said, I'm not a builder by any means in this game. Anyway, <laughs> I'm not a builder by any means in this game, and uh, yeah, so got a little bit of decoration here. Um, we'll be doing some uh, lighting in here as well. Uh, that's kind of cool, kind of separate this a little bit. The front doorway walk in over here. I can kind of, I don't know, I don't know what I'll do with it. I don't even know if I like that. Yeah, anyway, so uh, I think we'll call it here for right now. I mean, we're we're doing really good, we've got uh. A decent starter base. I'm probably going to have to adjust how close this is to my stairwell because I kind of don't like it. Maybe we'll start coming down about right here and meet down that way. Um, yeah, I mean, so far we've we've done a lot. Got food sorted out. Uh, home base situation. Diamonds. Hey, I, th I think we met all the criteria building in the taiga biome, which is a forest. I think we met all the criteria for your uh, start off in the world, Ziggy. So uh, anyway, hope you enjoy it. Keep gaming for fun.